Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be sharing my July kit and foil lineup. I'm so excited about this lineup. We are finally diving deep into the summer kits and I am so hyped. I'm obsessed with some of these foil pairings. I cannot wait to see these spreads laid down. So without further ado, I'm just going to go ahead and get started with the first full week of July, which is the 3rd through the 9th. Now, this is obviously the week of 4th of July. I've decided not to use a 4th of July kit this year. I'm just not really in the mood to celebrate America, but I am still using a kit that's still... I feel like it's a good 4th of July alternative because of the color scheme, and that kit is... Waterpark from Cross Press, which features exclusive artwork. I about died when I saw this kit. It is utter perfection. Probably going to be a color blocking moment if I'm being completely honest. I think a lot of people have said in their videos that they are going to be using this kit as their 4th of July spread as well. So I'm really excited to see everyone's spreads when that time comes around. So that is the full kit format. If I did not mention that before, this is the freebie that came with the kit. We have an extra skin tone box and a tall box. I did get this fashion option, which I'm obsessed with. And the 15 millimeter I went with is the water pattern. So I am going to be pairing this kit with hollow foil. And the very first thing I have is a mini foil bundle from Caress Press. This is her summertime foil bundle which looks a little something like this. I just thought this would be the perfect foil bundle to pair with this kit. So we have little, let's see, sun hats, sunscreen, bathing suits, all the things, and I am really hyped about this. This is what the headers and the extra full box page looks like, and then we have bottom washi, hole protectors, all that jazz. So that is it for the foil bundle. I'm also going to be pairing in, or pulling in, I should say, some quotes from Plan With Me stickers. These are her 4th of July quotes. I figured, you know, I'm not going all out for a 4th of July spread, but maybe I can pull in a couple 4th of July quotes. So we'll see if I end up using these or not. And then I'm also going to be pulling in underlays from Plan With Me stickers and... This is probably my favorite underlay design ever, and I swear there's like a million kits I could use these with, but I'm trying to resist and hold myself back. But anyways, these are the rippled water underlays, and I mean, in hollow, this is like blinding. This is going to look so freaking good. I am so excited about this. Yeah. It's going to be a good spread. I can already tell you guys. So anyways, that is it for the first full week of July. Next week is the 10th through the 16th. And for this week, I'm using yet another kit from Caress Press. This is a very Caress Press heavy month, if I'm being honest. But this is the May mystery from this year called Beach Club. Another straight banger from Crest Press. I'm literally obsessed with it. I love the people we meet on vacation book right there. I think the color scheme is fantastic. Honestly, when I first picked this kit up, I was like, do I hoard it for a future vacation? Because it's so good. It would look amazing if I was actually, like, it would be really fantastic to use this kit for an actual vacation. But I decided that I seriously cannot hoard this kit like I need to use it ASAP so I'm not doing anything special this week but I I had to use it so that is what the full kit format looks like and then of course we'll go through the extras and add-ons so one of the freebies was this tall box which I'm obsessed with the surfboards with like the drink menu on and then the other freebie was the red haired fashion girl I got the 15 millimeter, and then we have quite a few fashion add-ons. So we have these here and these, and I am obsessed with them. I'm hoping that this week is pretty busy so that I have a reason to use extenders so I can pull in as many full boxes as possible because it's going to be literally impossible for me to narrow down the full boxes this week. So... 
Anyways, that is the kit. Now, when I got this kit, well, first, this kit came with a dark green tropical foil bundle, which matches the dark green in the kit perfectly, and I thought that was an amazing foil pairing. However, when I saw the colors of this kit, I knew immediately that the dark green was not going to work for me, and I... I knew exactly what I was going to use. So I'm still using a tropical foil or tropical themed foil, but I'm pulling in a, some foil stuff from Planner Choco and I got everything in a mixed metal of light pink and black. And I'm really excited about this stuff. So let me go through the large stack of foil I have for this kit. So firstly, I have a couple of different sheets of deco you can see the foil there i have the hull protectors oops i'm sorry if i just shook the camera a little bit i about dropped everything i have the headers i have quite a few different designs of the full boxes so we have like the lined frames we have these like deco bits and then this one here that's going to be perfect for the double box within the kit. So that is that. And then for bottom washi, I have this one here, which is what usually comes in Planner Choco's. Did I say this stuff was from Planner Choco? I don't remember. But this is like this style of 15 millimeter that comes with Planner Choco's um, foil bundles. I got this specifically for the confetti, and then for the other one, I'm going to be pulling in this sheet here, which matches the underlay design. And then, I don't know why I got two sheets of each of these, but I did. So I'm definitely going to have quite a few extras, but this is what the underlays look like, and I'm super excited about these. I think they are stunning. They are so full and dense are going to look amazing under the labels and I cannot wait for them. So that is it for the second week of July. So next up is the 17th through the 23rd, which is also the week that the Barbie movie releases. And the Barbie movie is probably my most anticipated movie release of the entire year. I'm so excited about this movie. I'm fully prepared to make it like my entire personality trait like it's gonna be so good I know it is I'm so hyped so obviously I'm going to be using the Barbie kit from Scribble Prince Co which is actually called Life in Plastic so I'm really excited about this I think Jess did a really good job with the fashion people and at the time that this kit came out I feel like we only had like a 30 second like teaser trailer so I think this was really well done given like how little information we had about the movie at the time that this was released. So yeah, not mad about it whatsoever. I love this like chartreuse color. Is that what it's called? Love it very, very much. So that is the ultimate kit. And then of course we have some add-ons. So firstly, this was the freebie. The tall box, 100% going to use that. And then, of course, you guys know me. I can't resist the doodles. So, obviously, the foil pairing had to be pink. Like, how could you not use pink with a Barbie kit? So, I have some stuff from Alicia Craft. This is all from her doll collection, which I'm pretty sure is still available in her shop. But firstly, I have the foil bundle. So, I think this is in her just regular pink color if I'm not mistaken but we have eight full box overlays we have the sheet with the headers and the deco and the bottom washi and then of course I had to get some extra bits so firstly let's see we have if I can pick it up that would be nice I have an extra sheet of the confetti headers I have the matching hole protectors just kidding I have two sheets of the headers I got the quote box overlays I have the tall box overlay and then I got four sheets of the underlays and this is like the more like dense version of the underlays that she releases. I originally got like the more sparse version with the foil bundle and then I had a change of heart so I de those and picked up these so 
really excited about this spread. I feel like quite a few of us are going to be using this kit for this specific week. So that is it for the third week of July. And then the last week I have to go over with you guys is the 24th through the 30th. We're using another Caress Press Kit this week. This is Seaside, which is utter perfection. Like, Celeste Studio did a fantastic job with this art set. I love the blues. Obsessed with it. Everything about this kit is just perfection. So, this is what the kit looks like. Look at those colors. I'm just... I'm color blocking 100%. This is going to be a color blocked spread. I especially really love the darkest blue. I think it is stunning. Okay, we have the bottom washi. And then we have, let's see, this was the freebie that came with the kit. Obsessed with the lighthouse. Obsessed with the golden retriever. I picked up this fashion girl here, and then for the bottom washi, I chose the darkest blue, because again, it's my fave. And then I'm going to keep, because I kind of went a little overboard with like underlays and stuff earlier in the month, I'm going to keep it pretty simple with foil this week. So I'm going to be pulling in the seashells foil bundle from Caress Press in her, I think she calls it ocean blue, but it's definitely like a blue hollow color. And I just thought this would be like really perfect for this because this kit has like corals and sand dollars and seashells throughout. So I thought this would be a nice touch. So we have the eight full boxes here. This is the full format. So we have, uh, I almost said underlays, headers, bottom washi, scripts and icons, which I won't use. And then we have the bougie boxes. So that is it for the fourth week of July, and that is actually it for this spread, or this video, this month, whatever. You guys know what I'm talking about. Um, let me know in the comments down below if we're twinning with kits or foil at all this month. Let me know which spread you are most excited to see. As always, I'll have all the shops featured linked in the description box down below as well as any coupon codes or referral links I have for them. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!